Hello everyone. This is Kiran here. Today we are going to see how to trace a cartoon image in Illustrator using Pathfinder options. With that, we are going to see pen tool, shape builder tool and default shapes like rectangle, circle, etc in Adobe Illustrator. In previous video, we saw how to trace a cartoon image using pen tool and default shapes in Photoshop. Now, we are going to see how to trace using Pathfinder option in Illustrator. In Illustrator, we have a tool called Pathfinder. The Pathfinder palette is a huge time saver when creating detailed vector designs in Adobe Illustrator. Where we can find Pathfinder in Illustrator? Go to Windows, Pathfinder. You can see there. Using Pathfinder option, we can create custom shapes and paths by using the versatile shape modes and pathfinders within the panel. So now, let's start with this cartoon image. First, create a layer and if you see this cartoon image, we can trace with pen tool and with pathfinder tools and default shapes. We can use anything. The only thing we should have in the mind is to trace and finish it soon and clean with perfect tips and tricks and method. Create a rectangle, click and drag in the document for perfect square, use shift. Give none to the fill color and apply the stroke color and increase the stroke size. Now click and drag a ellipse using shift for perfect circle. We are going to duplicate the circle. For that, using alt in the keyboard, click and drag the circle, we will get a duplicate. Select all the shapes and let me use the pathfinder tool. In pathfinder tool, Use shape modes, unite option. You can see there, we got a new shape. Keep that aside. Now create a circle and let's draw the cartoon image eyes. Click and drag, use shift for the perfect circle. Now let's fill the color and give none for stroke color. Reduce the opacity for the shape so we can see the cartoon image clearly. Now we are going to duplicate the circle. Click and drag using Alt, we will get the duplicate option. Use transform and reduce the size. Now we are going to create that half curve. So select both the circle and in shape modes we are going to give the option called minus front. Now increase the opacity of the shape and use alt in the keyboard and duplicate the shape. You can see there how fast we are getting the shapes without using pen tool and curvature tool. Now I am going to use pen tool and create eyebrows so have a look. After tracing the left eyebrow, no need to trace the right eyebrow. First, duplicate the shape, use Alt and click and drag. After that, right click on the shape and go to the transform option, give reflect. In that, give vertical option and click OK. You can see there, it got reflected and we got the shape. Let's use default shapes like circle and rectangle and create the cartoon image. Have a look. Finally, we trace the cartoon image using pathfinder option, pen tool and default shapes in illustrator. Let's see the left out options in Pathfinder tool with different example. Let's place the camera vector design image and start tracing it using Pathfinder option. And the reason behind taking Pathfinder option like this, we can get a clear understanding and ideas about that tool. Okay, let's trace the second image. Click and drag a rounded rectangle and we can see the corner points that helps us to create sharp edges and curve edges. So click and drag it for the curve. 
then keep it aside and create a rectangle and change the color we can use eyedropper or else color palette to change the color now select both the shapes and use minus friend in shape modes we got the shape now give control is it let's try this with an another tool to create the shape again so it will be useful you can use both options go to the tools panel or press shift plus m in the keyboard for shape builder tool now select the two shapes and click the unwanted area holding alt on the keyboard and click it now you can see it it got deleted and if you notice here when i used pathfinder option the shapes was not separate after i used shape builder tool option the shapes got separated so we can take this as an advantage the advantage in this shape builder tool is it ungroup the shapes and gave us okay let's create the circle part in the camera image click and drag a circle using shift and change the color using color palette place it with the shapes and select all three shapes now in pathfinder option go to shape modes there give the option called exclude we got the shape but as i said before we did not use shape builder tool so we have to go to the menu option go to object and give ungroup so select the unwanted shape and delete and create a circle again using shift and place it in the center let's get back to the next shape click and drag a rectangle and adjust the points using direct selection tool and now create an another rectangle and change the color place it now give the same option we gave before exclude we saw how to create cartoon images using pathfinder option and pen tool and shape builder tool this is how we trace and create vector design with multiple tools let's see a glance of pathfinder option and i'm going to share you an important thing we would have noticed while using pathfinder option if you take your cursor near any option we can see it says use all plus click to create a compound shape what is the use of that let's see that with default shapes compound path and compound shape in illustrator are more complex they can interact in different ways using the four top buttons in the shape modes panel if you ever played with pathfinder shape mode options you probably come to know about compound shape a compound shape allows you to achieve the same result but in more versatile manner you can easily create a compound shape by selecting the desired objects and select those by using unite shape mode while holding down the alt key now see there what happens if we use alt and click the shape modes option we can edit using direct selection tool in live itself and shapes are alive it's not deleted we can create new designs this is the use of compound shape and have a look what happens if i use the options in pathfinder panel below shape modes since it lets you select any composing object using either direct selection tool or the layer panel and then edit its position size and shape at any point in time we won't use more option in pathfinder panel because it will be similar with shape modes option minus front is similar to minus back
Likewise, intersect option in shape modes is similar to crop option in Pathfinder. So we use less options in Pathfinder to create vector designs. This is all about Pathfinder in Illustrator. I have explained major options in Pathfinder using cartoon images and designs because it helps us to learn more and know clearly about the options. And I have used Pathfinder and Trace logos so let me share the video link in the description below. Check that out will be useful for you. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you. Peace.